human remains and artifacts in remote, rarely occupied caves get preserved much better than in the open landscape. For decades, the mainstream narrative is that permanent dwellings came about only around 10,000 BC, with the invention of agriculture and animal husbandry. Before that, Paleolithic people were forced to move around all the time to follow their food and lived under the shelter of caves and tepees. But early humans and other extinct hominoid species were never really cavemen. They did not set up permanent homes in caves and merely used caves as temporary shelters during their seasonal wanderings. The misconception of prehistoric people being cavemen. Relates to the rudimentary archaeological work done in the 19th century. Human remains and artifacts in remote, rarely occupied caves get preserved much better than in the open landscape, which leads to this biased idea. Later studies have proven that archaic humans mostly resided in the open air settings near water. Desirable locations such as plains close to fresh water bodies, travel and trade routes. Would have been reoccupied and rebuilt countless times by various human groups for hundreds of thousands of years. Our modern cities in the old world might even have rooted from popular and populated Paleolithic sites.